Hi everyone and welcome to Creative Cakes by Sharon. Today I have something a little different for you and even though I've made a special cake for my video, it's not a tutorial. I wanted to chat to you about something quite serious that I'm sure most of you have already heard about and that's the deadly Ebola virus. In particular, I wanted to highlight and share with you some of the great work being done by a group of very caring and capable people who also belong to the American branch of global humanitarians known as Medicines du Monde or the Doctors of the World. The cake I have made is my own representation of how the hands of the Doctors of the World are supporting this global health issue. It's important that we try to learn as much about the virus as we can and support those who are working hard against it. We should try to make our knowledge more viral than the virus itself. This virus is spread by direct contact with bodily fluids of people who have already become ill with the disease. Ebola is not spread through casual contact, nor is it airborne like the flu. People are contagious only after they begin to show symptoms such as a fever, fatigue, vomiting, loss of appetite, muscular pain, a headache and sore throat. Around the world, authorities are doing all they can with the skills, knowledge and resources they have to stop the spread of Ebola. This means identifying each case, isolating ill people and making contact with others who have been around the ill person to assess their risk. At present, there is no cure or vaccine for the Ebola virus. However, work is in progress on this front. The Doctors of the World group are fighting this situation on many fronts. They are working to protect communities, strengthen prevention strategies, support healthcare workers and keep the healthcare systems open for other patients. In remote areas, the doctors of the world are trying to prevent transmission, trace contacts and support local health workers. So what can you do to help? The first thing you can do is become more familiar with all of the facts about Ebola and there is terrific up-to-date information that can be found at www.doctorsoftheworld.org. The second thing you can do is donate to help fight the Ebola virus. Monetary donations are more valuable at present than in-kind contributions. Please click the link on the screen now if you would like to donate to the Doctors of the World to become part of the fight against this Ebola virus. Hopefully, as a global community, we can support the Doctors of the World in their efforts and work against Ebola to reach a positive future for all of us. Please don't forget to donate to the Doctors of the World and thank you for watching.